in Panama City today and in the Bayou George area off Highway 2301 talking about the upcoming Renaissance and Cultural Fair. It's the fourth annual event. I'm having a lot of fun today for News 13 this morning, checking it all out. Darcy Blakely and the crew are here to give us a little bit more of a preview about the event. There's some LARPing going on behind us because this event is all about the medieval fun. So tell me a little bit about what is the Renaissance and Cultural Fair. Okay, the Renaissance and Cultural Fair is about you know, learning about our history too, which is kind of amazing. And, um, but we're looking, we're looking to have a cultural art center here. And uh, it's going to be called the Morning Star Center for Art, so we can preserve the arts. That's what we're really all about that's coming here in this area. Yeah, that's wonderful. So, so this yeah. weekend, though, is the big yeah. fair you guys have. It's yeah. on Saturday and Sunday. Give us a little bit more of the details. Okay, Saturday and Sunday from 10 to 5. And um, it's only five dollars. It's really reasonable to get in, and the children can bring uh, some canned food for animals, like a cat or a dog food. It's really cheap to get in, but we're helping to, you know, to help with the. Um, that's our one of our nonprofits that we're giving some money back to, and uh, also Crystal Cottage. We've been praying for peace for 35 years here, so we're a peace center, and that's where some of the money goes to to help us keep going. Wonderful, you got yeah. You're going to have a blood yeah. drive too, and some yes. different ways people can get involved. What though should people look forward to this weekend besides the LARPers? I know you'll have some horses and some jousting, a lot of good food. Tell us a little bit more about that. We have all kinds of vendors coming in. Um, we have. Um, tattoo artists and different things like that and we have readers card readers and um, lots of wonderful food we're going to have the big uh, turkey legs Yum. to eat and uh, our food is awesome and uh, I'm just trying to think of all the different things but we have a lot of yeah. interesting fun activities we have a mermaid come going to be here doing you know uh, different medieval just, stuff yeah well, I don't know about a mermaid being in the <laughs> but... No, but, yeah, no, there's just so much, though, with that theme. Why is it so important to you guys this year to have this event? Well, it's important because we, we've suffered a little bit through the Hurricane Michael, and uh, this is giving uh, the neighbors and our friends around to have the opportunity to feel a little bit happier and just kind of forget about all the woes, and uh, that's really what we're about.